Welcome to our Tech Explainer video. Today, we're tackling an important question that many developers encounter in their coding journey. Our viewer asks, is the atomic integer increment and get method thread safe? They mention that they don't see any use of the synchronized keyword in their implementation, and they're concerned about potential issues when multiple threads call this method to generate unique IDs. Welcome back to another technical video. Today, I'll be going through your question, answering it, and hopefully finding that solution you're looking for. Guys, remember to stay just a little bit crazy, just like me, and hopefully you work through to that resolution. Let's get started. Let's address the question about the thread safety of the atomic integers increment and get method. The increment and get method of atomic long is indeed thread safe. This means that multiple threads can safely call this method without causing any data inconsistency. The reason it is thread safe is that atomic long uses low level atomic operations provided by the Java virtual machine, which ensures that the increment operation is performed atomically. In your code, when you call unique ID generator .instance .increment and get, it will safely generate unique IDs even when accessed by multiple threads simultaneously. In conclusion, you can confidently use increment and get in a multi-threaded environment without worrying about synchronization issues. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. Yes, the increment and get method of atomic integer is thread safe. In fact, all classes in the atomic package, like atomic long, are designed for thread safety. These classes support lock-free programming for single variables, allowing for atomic updates without locks. Classes like Atomic Boolean, Atomic Integer, and Atomic Reference provide methods for safe access and updates to their respective types, including atomic increment methods. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. Yes, the increment and get method of atomic integer is thread safe. It's part of the java.util concurrent package, which is designed for concurrent programming. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. Yes, the increment and get method of atomic integer is thread safe. It's designed to ensure that each thread accessing it gets a unique number. Atomic long is often used for tasks like atomically incremented sequence numbers, making it reliable in multi-threaded applications. And that's it guys. I hope that's found the answer that you were looking for and you got through to that solution. If you did, please hit the subscribe button. I'd really appreciate it. And until the next time, you have a technical issue, I'll see ya. Have a good one.